various Chrysler and Dodge transmission systems such as the 41TE, the 42LE, the 42RLE, the 5 and 45 RFE transmissions have at times produced a diagnostic trouble code 1776 which Chrysler defines as the solenoid switch valve latched in the lower verse position. To understand what this code indicates, it's good to understand how the lower verse solenoid functions. After an upshift out of first gear has occurred, the lower verse solenoid doubles as a lockup solenoid. In order for this to occur, a valve in the valve body called the solenoid switch valve must stroke to redirect solenoid control pressure to the TCC control valve. If it does not, the lower verse solenoid control pressure is allowed to enter into the lower verse clutch circuit. The lower verse pressure switch is in that pressure circuit, which then closes before the lower verse clutch has a chance to apply, causing a severe bind-up. When the computer sees this illegal signal, code 1776 sets and the computer initiates the limp mode function. For the 41TE, 42LE, and 42RLE transmissions, one such cause can be a defective solenoid block. For LH vehicles, solenoid blocks that are prone to this problem can be easily identified with Julian dates that fall between 3001 and 0603. The first three characters are the day of the year, while the fourth represents the year. So a 3001 would be the 300th day on 2001. These Julian dates are either dot peened or printed on the solenoid block near the pass through connector. So according to these Julian dates, there are solenoid blocks between the 300th day of 2001 to the 60th day of 2003 that could produce code 1776. Chrysler's TSB on this subject also points out that if the manual valve was not fully placed into the overdrive position due to the shifter cable either being out of adjustment or defective, code 1776 will also set. This gives us a clue that a malfunctioning transmission range sensor could also produce the code.